Hey y'all, welcome to my YouTube channel. In uh, this video, I'm about to show you how you can fix uh, Forza Horizon 3 crashing and um, problems with, uh, you know, launching or crashing issues. So make sure you watch this video till the very end and subscribe for more tutorials. I really appreciate it and really help a lot this uh, small YouTube channel. So I'm going to share with you what I've tested myself and it works for me. So yeah, make sure you watch this video. And now without further ado, let's jump right in the video. So what you have to do guys is first of all we have to make sure we have the latest updates and also we need to have on our computer microsoft visual c++ so install this click on here and install also download DirectX. this is what you need to run games pretty much so click on download now and then but, but if you already have you already have direct x and microsoft this one then just ensure that you have the latest drivers if you have a nvidia graphic card just click on the download now and we need to install um geforce experience and here what you have to do here is just to click on drivers and check for updates so you can check for updates and install all the drivers you need in order to run any game pretty much so just install any driver any you start GeForce experience and then click on drivers and install the driver if there's any available driver click on check for updates now the next step go to windows updates and hold up is not you don't have to really like if there's a huge list of windows updates here then 100 percent make sure you install windows updates but if it's only one then that won't be a problem but now let's go to advanced options and then optional updates and then driver updates. And here, if driver updates for you, this list is huge. If it's only one, then that's fine. But for me, when I checked up, up, optional updates, this list was huge. Several updates were available. And so just click on the, check this box and click on download and install. So we can install all the drivers we need to run this game, right? And here, as I, I'll leave the links in the description of this video, so you can install uh, this auto detect, so and detect there's any available drivers here as well. So yeah, I'll leave the links in the description of this video. Now the next step, we have to use command prompt and run as a mini share. And now just make sure you enter this command first and click on enter. And this will begin a system scan and will just verify. Uh, your system if there's any corrupted files all right just wait for the verification to complete and now just restart your computer and your the game should work just fine so yeah remember install all the drivers you need so you can run the game and play the game so i really hope guys this video helped you so you can enjoy the game and have some fun and i hope you're gonna have a fantastic day just take care and i'll see you in the next video and also make sure you subscribe i really appreciate it take care